What's up with your world? What's up with your YouTube? This is man, Mr. JR, the Dread Roster, Pharaoh Jr. checking in with you live and direct and full effect. Right now, I'm making a video about a topic that I've always been hearing since I was a youngin', and even to this day, I still hear it. And it seems as if now that I'm older, I hear it a lot more. This topic is what color is Jesus? What race is Jesus? How did he look? Um, growing up, you know, uh, when I heard the story of Jesus, you know, I, I always wondered, you know, uh, who, who is this mystical man? You know, I'm talking about who is this this man? You know, I'm talking about that 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 done did so much for us. You know, I'm talking about he laid his life out for us, for our sins and everything. You know, I'm talking about for us to get in heaven. You feel me? So, I, I, I ain't even gonna lie. At times, you know, I, I done been so concerned with it. You know, I'm talking about trying to do my research and everything, trying to find out how did Jesus look and what color is he? You know, I'm talking about I done did my fair amount of research and everything like that, but, um, I'm going to tell you my opinion before I go further about this topic. Growing up, I used to go to a Catholic church when I was younger. You know what I'm talking about? Um, my, my, uh, my dad's side of the family, or my dad and my grandma, you know, that, that's, that's who I somewhat grew up with. I grew up with my grandma when I was younger, wasn't that, you know what I'm talking about? And my dad, he was there every now and then. But uh, they Catholic, you understand? And, um, they went on like he was a white man, you know what I'm talking about? And ain't nothing wrong with that. If Jesus is a white man, you know what I'm talking about? Hey, hey ain't nothing wrong with that. In my opinion, really ain't nothing wrong with that. Because as I say in all my videos, stop focusing on people's image and focus on their actions. And Jesus Christ's actions clearly shows that he loved all of us. You know what I'm talking about? People of our race or whatnot. So... However, the man image is it, it don't matter if he if he if he was defined ugly, you know what I'm talking about. He was ugly. If he if he was defined beautiful, he he was defined beautiful. You know what I'm talking about. But the man actions clearly show that he laid his life on the line for us. You understand what I'm talking about. So the man's image really doesn't matter to me. But okay, growing up. You know, uh, since since the churches that I used to go to when I was younger, they 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 showed that he was a white man with long blonde hair, brown hair or whatnot. You know, what I'm talking about um, I thought he was a white man. You know, what I'm talking about um, but as I started getting older and I started uh, I, I've always been around different races. You know, what I'm talking about I've been around. Uh, uh, Asians, uh, blacks, uh, whites, uh, Indonesian, uh, I, I guess, it, uh, a better term for them would be Middle Eastern, um, African, uh, I never, I never been around an Australian person yet, I haven't met an Australian person yet, you know what I'm talking about, um, South American, Spanish, I, I done been around them folks, you know what I'm talking about, but, uh, I've always been around different races. I love being around other races. You know what I'm talking about? Growing up, that's how I always been or whatnot. Um, I didn't got disrespected by some races. You know what I'm talking about? Um, they didn't call me a nigga or, you know what I'm talking about? Call me, call me some type of name that referred to my skin color or whatnot. You know what I'm talking about? But it's all good, though. You know what I'm talking about? As I done said before in all my videos, the devil getting in some people's mind state. And he takes over them and then got now and they start to hate you feel me so when i started growing up you know i was like oh no i kept on hearing some people say oh he a white man oh he black oh he in the indonesian he middle eastern you know what i'm talking about he he indian you feel me so I took the time out these last couple of years and did my own fair amount of research or whatnot. And based on the metaphor descriptions given in the Bible 
And once again, I'm gonna repeat that. Metaphor descriptions, meaning that they don't give you no full detailed description. They don't give you no basic description on how this man looked. Ain't no simple, oh, he was white, he, he had pale skin, or oh, he was black, his skin was brown. You know, uh, it's, it's metaphor descriptions given in the Bible. Wouldn't that, you know what I'm talking about? His hair felt like wool. They don't say it was black or anything like that. You know what I'm talking about? So, in my research that I done did, I believe Jesus was a, a color of black. I believe he, he had a skin color for Ethiopian person or whatnot. Uh, when they say he had hair like wool, or whatnot. Since I've been around plenty of different races or whatnot, you know, I'm talking about I didn't have my fair amount of uh girlfriends from different races and everything like that. I've had the opportunity to uh, feel their hair, feel my hair and feel other black people here. And um whenever I feel black folks here it feel like wool. But before before you know some of y'all that 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 that, that feel like if he's black, we 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 are superior and everything. Or if he's white, oh the white race is superior. Nah, it, it don't work like that. Unfortunately, uh, no matter what color Jesus was, it won't matter. You know what I'm talking about? Because once again, it's about the actions that the man did for us. It's not his image. You gotta remember his mama was a virgin. You understand what I'm talking about? The Lord created Jesus inside of her. She she was a virgin. She never had sex, never had no sexual relationships with no man. So he didn't have no earthly father. Yes, he did have an earthly father to guide him in his footsteps or whatnot, you know what I'm talking about, but also the Lord revealed to him what his purpose was or whatnot. But uh what it is I'm trying to say is no matter what color it is you think Jesus is it won't never matter. No matter how you think the man looked based on your opinions or what's given in the Bible, it won't matter. The man laid his life out on the line for us. So the ones that choose to follow the path of righteousness, you know what I'm talking about, shall see the gates of heaven. You understand what I'm talking about? So if, if he a black man, a white man, an Asian man, an Indonesian man, the Middle Eastern, or Australian or whatever, you know what I'm talking about? It won't, it won't matter. The thing is, he put his life on the line for us to see the gates of heaven. All people under the sun, different shades, will have the opportunity to enter this kingdom. I've been seeing on the, uh, on YouTube or whatnot a whole lot of people that, that's, that's been coming about this whole Israelite thing or whatnot. You know what I'm talking about? They believe that, uh, they believe that uh, our Israelites are going to, to uh, heaven or whatnot. Last time I checked, I'm in the Old Testament and just got done with the story of Ruth. I'm now in Samuel or whatnot. Last time I checked, you had hundreds of thousands of Israelites that disobeyed the Lord's orders and he would cast them into other nations and uh, he murdered. The Lord took a whole lot of these people's lives because they kept on worshiping other gods. You understand what I'm talking about? And I'm, I'm speaking about Israelites and this is in the Old Testament. So, if he murdered, you know, the people, his people or whatnot, you know what I'm talking about, because he wor they worship other gods, what make y'all think that today, you know, it's going gonna, it's gonna to change or whatnot? By you, by you, you know, still doing sin and everything like that, you live your life in sin and you glorify that, you know what I'm talking about, what make you think that he's going to change just because you think you have the blood of the Israelite, you know what I'm talking about? That's, that's personal in my opinion, you know what I'm talking about? I'm reading the Bible to get myself understanding and see what I, I get to understand from it, you know what I'm talking about? But that's basically that right there. Uh, I'm going to make a quick part two with that to finish up what it is I'm trying to say about this topic. So y'all just bear with me and ride with me. It ain't going to be that long. It's going to be quick. So y'all hold it down.